Here's the problem for some drivers. They're heading west on East Broadway in Cuyahoga Falls, and when their GPS tells them to turn right, they mistake the train tracks for the entrance to 8 North. Pictures from June 27th show the aftermath after Parth Patel from Columbus made that error with this Acura. Unfamiliar with the area, he relied on his GPS. And I made the right turn, but it ended up being the train tracks. Patel tried to put it in reverse, but he was stuck. When he heard a train coming, he ran to safety. Everything was going so fast in my head, and but it was scary. It was really scary. We tested our GPS, which also told us to turn before the tracks. Turn right, then keep right. Obviously, if your GPS tells you to turn now, some people turn now. Mayor Don Walters knows of three cases this year where drivers following GPS commands turned onto the tracks. Over the last 10 years, the city counts 37 cars getting stuck on the rails. Six got hit by trains. Luckily, no injuries or fatalities. We obviously want to protect the motoring public, so we're taking all these steps. Those steps include painting white lines to define the edge of the roadway, improved lighting, and soon a new Route 8 entrance ramp sign. At nighttime, with the illumination, it can be deceiving and it appears that the train tracks could be the road. After his close call, Patel is happy the tracks are getting more attention. It's just an easy mistake to make, so I don't really think the GPS is a huge factor. I'm sure people have made a mistake without a GPS. In Cuyahoga Falls, Bob Jones, News Channel 5.